So there are a lot of toxic insecticides and pesticides on the market today. So VJ, um, why is Azagard Biosafe's insecticide a powerful alternative for agricultural users? Well, uh, Azagard um, is basically it's it's classified as a botanical insecticide. Um, this is a, this is a, this is the first first line of insecticides that Biosafe Systems has brought into the market um, this year, actually in 2010. Um, Azagard is again it's it's a botanical insecticide. Um, uh, the the active component of azagard is azadirectin. Um, the azadirectin is a is a compound that uh, derived from uh, derived from neem tree. Basically, it's it's a it's a compound that's derived from from the seeds of of the neem tree. Um, and azadirectin has been uh, researched over the last few decades as as one of the most powerful. Um, Powerful insecticides, the natural insect insecticides um, that has been brought um, into uh, into the commercial agricultural uh, market. Um, there has been a lot of research that has been done over the last few decades with with azadirectin, um, and uh, currently the market has different formulations of azadirectin uh, put in put in as as an insecticide. Um, as a guard, uh, Basically, has three percent azadirectin. That's a concentration of the active component in in the in the azagard. Um, and azagard again, it's it's a botanical insecticide. Um, it's uh, it's uh, it's a it's a completely natural product. Um, it's AMRI certified uh, for use in organic production. Um, and uh, and the and the mode of action of azagard actually azagard works in three um, three different ways. Um, the, the product actually works um, as as a larvicide. Uh, it actually works as a larvicide, um, uh, uh, killing larvae. I mean, if if um, say for example, if if you're if you're applying this product um, uh, to the crop where the insects uh, where, where the where the stage of the insect is still is either larvae or nymph stage, uh, and if you apply this product at those stages, it actually acts as a larvicide. Um, or, and also, it can also kill the name, the nymphal stages. Um, and the second mode of action is it the the azagard works as an works as an anti um, When I mean anti feedant is that uh, when you spray azagard on your crop, um, uh, the the one of the properties of of the active component, the azadirectin, is that it actually repels the insects. It's a uh, it has it has bitter properties um, it, by itself, so that actually makes the insects to 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 go away from from the site where 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 the azadirectin is sprayed. So so when you spray azagard onto a crop, uh, basically the insects um, really don't like to be in that area. So so basically it acts as an anti-feedant um, and basically as a repellent. And uh, one of the other ways that the one of the one of the other ways that azagard acts on um, on the, on the insect population is it actually interferes uh, in the developmental phase of the insect. Um, and one of one of the one of the processes that by the way by which the insects actually develop from from uh, from the nymphal stages to the adult stages is basically by molting. Um, and uh, the uh, the egg diasome. Uh, basically, but through the diastone, I think the, the 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 insect actually develops from from the nymphal stages to the adult stages, and uh, azagard uh, the the azadirectin, which is the active principle of azagard, basically interferes with the molting process of the, of the of the developmental phase of the insect. So uh, it basically stalls the insect development during the process, and uh, basically insect don't grow into an adult and. Uh, and by which by which you're basically reducing the population of insects in your uh, in your crop. So again, it actually acts as in three ways. It works. At, it acts as a um, it acts as an insecticide, as a larvicide, acting directly on the larvae um, of the insect. Um, it acts as an anti-feedant. Um, um, and uh, in the, the the third way is ov position inhibitor. Basically, it interferes with with the molting process. Um, stalling the development of the insect uh, and not allowing it to grow to the to the adult phase.